Hey folks, welcome back to another episode of Military Forces Unleashed. Today we're diving deep into the future of naval warfare. But hold on, this isn't just another tech showcase. We're talking about the cutting-edge trends that are redefining naval power. From destroyers to autonomous systems and even futuristic ship designs, we'll explore how naval warfare is evolving to tackle threats we've only started to imagine. Well, let's find out. In this video, we'll explore the history, current trends, and future design innovations shaping the naval battlefield. Whether it's stealth tech, AI-driven combat systems, or the role of cyber warfare, we're covering it all. And yeah, we'll throw in some of the juicy problems and controversies along the way, because nothing's perfect, not even a billion-dollar warship. Let's rewind to the early 20th century. Naval warfare was undergoing a transformation, with new ship classes emerging to meet the demands of modern combat. Destroyers, for instance, were born out of necessity. Small, fast ships designed to protect larger vessels from torpedo attacks. The first of their kind, like the Royal Navy's HMS Havoc in 1893, were essentially floating gun platforms. They had one job, keep the big boys safe. Fast forward to World War II, and naval designs had transformed drastically. Destroyers became Swiss Army knives of the sea, and larger vessels like aircraft carriers began to dominate naval strategies. The USS Fletcher class, for example, became legendary for its versatility and ruggedness during the Pacific campaigns. Submarines and cruisers also played pivotal roles, each class bringing unique strengths to the table. Curious fact, during the Battle of Samar in 1944, a group of destroyers and destroyer escorts, outgunned and outnumbered, charged a Japanese fleet of battleships and cruisers. It was sheer audacity, and it worked. If naval innovation had a motto, it would probably be something like, punching above our weight since day one. So, what makes a modern naval fleet tick? Let's start with the basics. Ships today are bristling with advanced weaponry, radar systems, and defense technologies. Take destroyers, for example. The Arleigh Burke class carries everything from Tomahawk cruise missiles to Aegis combat systems that can track and neutralize incoming threats faster than you can say hypersonic. But they're just one piece of the puzzle. Looking ahead, the future of naval design is all about integration and adaptability. Stealth technology isn't limited to destroyers. It's shaping the way submarines, frigates, and even aircraft carriers are built. Imagine entire fleets that are practically invisible to radar. Ships like the Zumwalt class may look like sci-fi creations, but their designs represent a broader trend toward reducing radar signatures and enhancing survivability. And then there's the tech. Autonomous systems are becoming a staple across all ship classes. AI-driven drones can scout, attack, or defend, all while the human crew focuses on the bigger picture. Think of it as having a fleet of robotic assistants that never need coffee breaks. Let's talk about multi-mission capabilities. Modern naval platforms aren't just about big guns anymore. Ships are being designed to take on anti-ship, anti-air, and anti-submarine roles all at once. The key here is modularity. Instead of building a new ship for every mission, you slap on the right systems like a military-grade Lego set. One of the most hyped trends? Lasers. Yes, lasers. They're not just for shooting down drones, they can disable enemy sensors or even detonate incoming missiles. Sure, it's not quite the Death Star, but give it time. And let's not forget about hypersonic weapons. These are missiles that travel faster than Mach 5, making them nearly impossible to intercept. Naval platforms of the future will not only deploy these weapons, but also develop countermeasures. It's a classic arms race and no one wants to be left behind. Cyber warfare is another critical area. Ships today are floating networks, and that makes them vulnerable to cyber attacks. Modern designs are incorporating robust cyber defenses and even offensive capabilities to stay ahead in this digital battlefield. 
Here's the thing. Modern naval platforms are incredible, but they're far from flawless. First off, they're expensive. The Zumwalt class, for instance, comes with a price tag of around $4 billion per ship. That's not even counting the $800,000 it costs to fire one of its advanced shells. Yeah, you heard that right. A single round costs as much as a small house. Then there's the issue of maintenance. These ships are packed with cutting-edge tech, which is great until something breaks, and in a combat scenario, you can't exactly call tech support. Let's also talk about cyber vulnerabilities. Modern fleets rely heavily on digital systems, which makes them targets for cyber attacks. Imagine your multi-billion dollar fleet being rendered useless because some hacker halfway across the globe decided to have a field day. On the global stage, the competition is heating up. The US Navy's Arleigh Burke and Zumwalt classes are often seen as benchmarks, but other nations aren't sitting idle. China's Type 055 destroyer, for instance, is a beast in its own right, featuring advanced radar systems and a massive payload capacity. Russia's Admiral Gorshkov class is another contender, boasting impressive stealth capabilities and hypersonic missile integration. And then there are emerging players like India and South Korea, investing heavily in naval programs to assert their regional dominance. It's a naval arms race, and the stakes couldn't be higher. So what does the future hold for naval warfare? One thing's for sure, it's not just about destroyers. As naval warfare evolves, entire fleets are being reimagined with technologies like AI, stealth, and cyber capabilities. Whether it's futuristic destroyers, next-gen aircraft carriers, or autonomous submarines, the seas are about to get a lot more crowded and a lot more complex. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the world of naval warfare, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and share this video with your fellow military enthusiasts. Let's keep the conversation going in the comments below. What do you think the ultimate naval fleet of the future will look like? Thanks for watching, folks. Your support means the world to us. Stay tuned for more military insights, and as always, stay sharp and stay curious. See you next time on Military Forces Unleashed.